welcome to the show. I'm Leo Stockos. I'm Rod James. I'm Jeff Chisholm. And I'll tell you what, guys, like the sign said, we are at Lancaster Park Outdoor Resort, and what a place. You know what? I heard they got great big fish here. I'm looking for big smallmouth. <laughs> well, I know what's going to happen here, but you know what? This place has been around since 1967. Stick around, guys. That's going to be a fantastic show. Get him, bud. Get him. Ontario Toyota Dealers presents Fish TV. It's time to Toyota. Brought to you by Ontario Power Generation. Powering Ontario's future. Rapala, crafted from experience. Go RV in Canada. Bring back wildhood. And Cabela's, world's foremost outfitter. With your hosts, Leo Stakos, Ron James, and Jeff Chisholm. <laughs> Powder. That's a fish. There we go. Good fish, good fish. Yeah. That a boy. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Nice. Oh, he's gonna get tangled in that's the line. Line. Oh. That's a nice small mouth. Yeah, right that's there. a good one there, bud. Drop shot. Oh yeah, that a boy. Nice. I'm surprised he's by himself. Well, I think once we find the load, yeah. we'll see a school. Well, I would assume Jeffrey just marked the Garmin. Oh, I definitely did. <laughs> nice one, buddy. Top nice. shot. There you go. All right. Nice. Chunky. Yeah. Now, did he feel that. stronger in that current, Jeff, or was it just the same fight? Oh, well, it was a good fight. Good, strong, smallmouth fight. Well, look at how fat they are. We're in September. Time for them to eat. Go back and get another one. Leo and Jeff are using drop shot. And I've got a Carolina rig here, which is a, a weight, a bead. There we go. There we go. He's got one. See that? I told you I felt lucky about this spot. <laughs> so he hit it twice, Ron. So he actually ticked it, ticked it. But meanwhile, the burglar up front here, folks, Jeff Chisholm, yeah. is uh, looking at the screen going, there's a fish down there, there's a fish down there. And I'm like, I just felt something. And he goes, oh, really? Because I, I think I see one on the screen. <laughs> actually, it's because Leo's hearing's not that great. And I'm like, Leo, you got a fish on your bait. <laughs> <laughs> really? This could be true, because everybody who knows me knows my hearing is not that great. But I'll tell you what is great right now, a smallmouth bass. Nice. Right here on Lake St. Francis, right on the top left. Chef taught me this, by the way. I'm not going to lie. I'm not much of a drop shot guy. And Chef gave us some schooling on how to do it. And that's the fish right there. There you go. Very nice. Beautiful. Good one too, bud. Oh, oh yeah. He's a pig. Yeah. Look at that. Let me get the net for you there, bud. So this current is just ripping by this island here. You can just see it, see it moving there. We're just casting up along the rocks. All right. Mm -hmm. All right. Oh, oh yes, nice. buddy. He just rocked his spinner bait. Yeah, that guy just How'd rocked. How's that feel on the current there, Jeff? <laughs> Beautiful. Good. Just rock that Terminator spinner bait. Smallmouth fight hard. But current smallmouth fight really hard. <laughs> See all those weeds bent over down there in the current? He can go back home to them. He just pounded this Terminator spinnerbait. Oh, I lost it. No, I didn't. I got him. On the Carolina rig. <laughs> Wrong hand. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what did you get for grabbing our rod? <laughs> Still though, nice fish. Nice fish for sure. Oh yeah, another wrong with that nice fish. Spot. Look at the colors on that. Oh. We should mark that spot there. Yeah, Jeffrey. I did. Did you? I did. You're all over it already, are you? Oh my, they are fighting this current. <laughs> Holy. That's why I thought you had a monster. It's a good one. It is. Look at him, just look at <laughs> This is ridiculous. Oh, I barely got him. I got him oh, on the bottom one. On the bottom, look. On the bottom one. Don't lose it. it might. Bottom hook. Does that make sense oh. on the bottom hook? Bottom lip, maybe? Yes. Ooh. Tell you what, you're not used to fishing current. You better when you come here. <laughs> because the current here is unbelievable. But that's what you get, and a lot bigger than that as well. Lancaster Park, that whole park is absolutely gorgeous. And they got great fish too. Believe it or not, this is a one ounce tungsten weight here. And I'm just Carolina rigging a craw. That's how I got that fish. 
about a two foot lead. There's a little bead there and we're just drifting with the current. And you just gotta keep contact with the bottom. We're right? actually fortunate, Ron. We, we're not, we actually don't have a ton of current in this spot, but there were some other spots that we were actually moving two to two and a half miles per hour yeah. without touching the motor. Fish? Yup, it's a cow. <laughs> it's a pike. It looks like it's wrapped up maybe. That's the first pike <laughs> we've seen today. Yeah, I thought you had a giant, bud. He cranked it though, I'll tell you that much. Oh yeah, he just crushed it, guys. We know there's big muskie in here because Jeff's been seeing him on the Garmin. But <laughs> talk about, even the pike are strong here. There we go, back in the water she goes. <laughs> My God, look at that. Throw yeah. your net. Throw your net. He's just ahead of it. Like over there or no, to the left? No, that bare spot right here. You got him? Got him. Yeah, you got him. <laughs> Beautiful. I love that. We spotted uh, that fish. Nice. And you got him. He's <laughs> coming over. He's coming Sweet, over. dude. Nice. Appreciate that, Ron. <laughs> That's team fishing right there. That's right. He tasted your jerk bait at first. Yeah. And he didn't want nothing to do with it. That's a good point to have the follow-up bait. Oh, right there's another one. Oh, that's Jeff. <laughs> <laughs> there's another one. They're all over the place. That's wild. Nice. <laughs> all right. Need a hand, bud? Oh, I got my... Oh, oh I lost him, buddy. I lost him. Oh. Yeah. <sighs> that was fun. Crushed it, though. Yeah. He's nice. not a big one, but he was fun. That was a good one, though. All right, Ron, where's the one you just missed? He's got a sore mouth. Burglar. He's got a sore mouth, that one. It's now time for the Ontario Toyota Dealer's Tackle Box. Okay, guys, let's take a minute out of the action to show you exactly what we're using today. I'll tell you what, when you come to Lancaster Park Outdoor Resort, you'll want to bring a couple of baits, and this is one of them. The Terminator half-ounce spinner bait. Now, the key thing is these willow leaf blades because you can burn them underneath the surface of the water. We're throwing that on a medium heavy action rod with an R-type reel. I'm using 50 pound Suffix 832 brake. When we went deeper and we started drifting that brake out there to 25, 30 feet of water, the famous old drop shot right here. Now, with that current, you know, it's going about two and a half miles an hour, two miles an hour, you want a one ounce tungsten weight. That is the key. That'll get you to the bottom real quick with this goby colored plastic little bait here that does everything. Now you want a fluorocarbon lead on that and a lot softer rod tip. Good quality concept reel with good Suffix 832 braid as your main line. You bring this stuff to Lancaster Park and you're going to catch them just like we are right now. So let's get back to that fish TV action. Oh, oh. nice buddy. Oh yeah. He's, he's right there, but he's dogging. I only got him literally, literally on one hook, because that's all I have. <laughs> I thought he was like a five, bud. Well, the way he hit that, this is a good quality fish, though. Look at them still dogging oh, down there. Goodness, they're strong, man. I can tell you right now, I'm not that strong if I got to horse this in. Crushed it, though. No, this one wasn't getting off. I tell you, folks, if you come up here and throw these spinnerbaits on these shallow spots, when you get hit, you might as well put the gloves on with Mike Tyson because that's what it feels like. <laughs> I tell you what, they just crush it. And you, you better be hanging on to the Rapala rod because they'll be gone. What we're doing is fishing these current spots that where the current breaks and there's rock piles. And the current's flowing down here like two, three miles an hour, probably two miles an hour, eh, Jeff? Oh, easy. <laughs> and then it breaks off into these little bays and there's little rock piles. They'll go in and come out and feed in the current. Lancaster Park Outdoor Resort is awesome place to come. Well, it's got it all. How do you have fun on the lake? You build a community around it, which is exactly what they've done. But they started it in 1967. Family owned. Which is really rare these days, ladies and gentlemen. I'll tell you what, to have something that's still family owned to, to show that how much they care about it and to keep that going. And we're driving around yesterday and there's families and there's kids playing and it's safe. You can't get in or out without a pass. So you yeah. know your kids are gonna be safe there. And they have like 52 transit, somewhere around 52, 58 transient sites. So if you're ever driving by and you wanna come and visit the St. Lawrence River and uh, Lake St. Francis, you can just bring your trailer in, have a nice party. Hey, they also got a fantastic restaurant. They got a tiki bar. 
that seats like 200. Which we haven't seen yet, but I no. want to see it. And they have tribute bands. Yeah. Last week they had the Fleetwood Mac one. Fleetwood Mac, they have Elvis Presley. I mean, they do it right. Dude, there we go. Not a boy. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, baby. Oh, there's a tank. Keeping that fish down. Keeping that fish down, baby. We are on big fish. Look at how black that one is. I'm getting the net for this. Come on, buddy. Slow down. Keep that baby down. Oh, he's on the trail. He's on. I his, know, I know. He's on your trailer. He's on my trailer hook. Bring him up, bud. Okay, you ready? Hold on. I'm ready. Hold on. That's a giant. Hold on. Oh, he's not ready. Watch. I can't see him. Get him out of there. Get him out of there. Oh, I got him. You got him, buddy. You got oh, him, buddy. <laughs> There's a giant. Look at that, guys. That's a giant. <laughs> I didn't catch it and I'm shaking. Lancaster Park Outdoor Resort, baby. Oh. Great food, great people, and fantastic fishing. Big and look at how fat that thing is. You know what, bud? Can you do me a favor and put that in the live wheel and yeah, we'll let weird. them recoup for a little bit? This is one I have a look Sometimes at. Sometimes in, oh. shallow, in the shallow water, they get tired up fast, easy. <laughs> right away, Ron goes, yup, yup. <laughs> look at that. Now that, look at that. But I think we're staying in this area for a little bit, bud. You know what? You I gotta do. pick up Jeff sometime. I mean, it's been that quick, bang, bang, bang. And then when you find fish, we made that mistake this morning. Yeah, we, we left fish, yep. We left fish to find fish. You know, Brent, he really helped us because we've never been in the area before and he's fished here all his life, basically. He actually came to the river today and said, you know what, I'm gonna help you guys out. And he's just been a, a fantastic gentleman. Joy and, great. and Michael, also fantastic. From the oh. time we entered the gate, from yeah. that point on, they made us feel like family. But right now, I'm looking for a family of smallmouth. And we think we found them. Portions of Fish TV were brought to you by Mercury. Go boldly. Yeah. Crushed it again. Big fish, bud. Right on top of it, bud. This Look feels like a giant. Oh, it's a cow, dude. Oh, oh it's a cow. <laughs> Right on top of it. This is a okay, cow. Now, now I'm fishing. Now I'm oh. fishing. Unless you need the net. Oh no, I gotta get this thing. Oh. 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 Dude. He crushed it, didn't he? Oh. Look at how fat this thing is, bud. I think I just got whacked there, bud. Look at how fat this thing is. Oh. I like this spot. Come here. Oh. Oh, he's dark, too. Oh. You know what the funny thing is? He is not here by himself. I gotta get a picture of this. Look at how fat this fish is, dude. Oh yeah. Whoa, buddy. Crushed it. Look at that. Perfect. Wow. That is a good four pound fish. I think so. Look at the gut it's on it. It's not very long, but it is fat. It what? looks like me. Well, and you just finished saying. Look at how are we supposed to. Look at the side profiles, here? Leo. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta love Lancaster Park. I'm telling you folks, when they hit a spinner bait, it's like a freight train. It is so much fun. And there is so many of these fish in this lake. It's just crazy. There she goes. Look at that, baby. It's now time for the Motor Guy Tip of the Week. Hey folks, Neil Stockos here with the Tip of the Week. You know, we had a fantastic day. We're just pulling the boat out. It's just about to rain. We haven't got it yet, but I gotta tell you what, we have to figure these fish out. With the amount of current in this water, you got deep water, you got shallow water. We figured them out in the morning and we found out that they were shallow adjacent to rock and weed. We started following that pattern all the way around and we caught fish all day long. So the next time you come out here, figure out that pattern and you'll have a fantastic time just like we did. He's right there, he's right there, he's right Where? there. He's right there. Throw ahead of him. Throw. Yep. You'll get him now. He's coming over to it. He's coming over to it. Just sitting there. No, he followed you in. Yeah, maybe he did follow me in. For sure. When Jeff comes back, I want to have four giants in the live well. <laughs> <laughs> we, we got two. And... Oh, yeah, baby. <laughs> oh, oh, another one. Another pig. 
<laughs> Another cow bottle. <laughs> I just said to you, did you throw in there? There's a big boulder. Well, Watch I've been out. Well, I'm casting, but I got a four pounder on, and you're just. There. <laughs> I said it's too shallow. It's not shallow. It's holding cows. <laughs> that is nice. Right oh. on the top lip too. Yeah. Reach down and grab that guy, buddy. Crushed it again. Yeah. I tell you, folks, I had the worst morning in the world. <laughs> <laughs> it's starting I to shape up to be a decent did. day. Oh, maybe. Uh, uh, I got it. Oh. Oh. How's that feel? Yeah. <laughs> I woke up this morning and the coffee overflowed. And that's how my whole day started. I got tangled, backlashes all morning long. I'm frustrated. Nick and, and Leo and Jeff said, just calm down, you'll have a decent day. It's turning out to be a beauty. <laughs> and you forgot about the part how you were trying to wake me up knocking on the wrong door. Oh, that's right too, yeah. I was walking on the wrong door. Hopefully nobody, I didn't wake anybody up there, so look at how long that one is. I'm gonna put that in the live well for a picture later. Wow. Oh my God. Now, my, my day's starting to get Go oh, again, look. I got a frog in my foot. All I know is I don't care right now because I'm catching fish like this. <laughs> I'll take the frog in my foot all day long. I haven't thrown spinnerbaits for years because all this, you know what's funny? All this new technology comes out. And you got to try this and you got to try that. 25, 30 years ago, we were throwing spinnerbaits for fish. We still catch fish on spinnerbaits, especially the Terminator. Let me get the frog on my foot. <laughs> Hang around. We'll be right back with some more fish TV right after this. They're not biting those, folks. Oh. <laughs> As you notice, we got Jeff back in the boat. What, what happened was he went around with Brent and seen some areas because Brent's got to go. Thank goodness for Brent. Like, he's really helped us out a lot. Because, Great guy, uh, too. He went around in his boat and uh, got some spots while we were crushing them. Such as this one. <laughs> while we were crushing the fish. <laughs> that one's swimming down there? Yeah. Good oh, one too, bud. Nice. What do you see how dark this one is, bud? Yeah, I see how black it was with a jump. Oh! Nice. Oh, yeah. When do you want to grab the net for me there, gentlemen? Nobody netted my four pounders. I did. No, you didn't. I hand bombed them. <laughs> like a champ. Oh, look at them digging under the water here, bud. Okay, Ronnie, you ready, yeah. bud? I thought there was another one with it. Oh. Oh. No. There, there you go. go. Thank you so much, that sir. That's a good one. Yes, baby. Caught him right on the edge of that weed. There's a weed bed over there. Yep. Weed bed. <laughs> <laughs> That's another, another good one. Another giant smile. Oh. Lancaster Park, buddy. Look at that. This one here, folks, has got a chunk out of it. So imagine what is in here eating these. Look at that. Look at that. Isn't that just insane? Throw that one the light well, too. Oh, yeah, buddy. You know we'll what? let these all go later. We're going to let this guy relax a little bit. I would like putting him back in for a there bit. There we go. Another yeah, one? Yeah, good one, too. <laughs> nice, bud. Oh, oh yeah. Nice jump. I just finished laughing at Jeff. I said, we keep waiting for you to catch a fish <laughs> with that thing. There? Another one below what? Is there? What is oh, that? Uh, oh, it's, it's a, a sucker. No, uh, it's a big uh, drum. It's a big drum. Yeah. Well, you schooled me there, Mr. <laughs> Chisholm. Well, they hit it dead. Well, let me show you first cast. <laughs> I have no clue what it imitates at all. A little goby. Oh, does it? Oh, yeah. A little goby. Oh, right on, bud. There you go. Yeah. Just Another. that simple little worm, it floats, light jig head, stands up, imitates a goby feeding off the bottom. Yeah. And they'll catch those all day long. Nice colors on that oh, one yeah. too, eh? Yeah. Look at the bars on that one. A lot of them are really light, but this one's got some color. A lot of these it. fish are like white when yeah. you catch them. That one's got the bars on it. Boy, buddy. Giant, all right. Giant, giant. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> Try it. Keep him on there, bud. You want the net? Uh, yeah, buddy. He's way out there. <laughs> <laughs> Run the net? Run he's the got net? 50 yards on me yet. Yeah, he's running to Montreal right now. He's out there. <laughs> oh, look at him. Look at him. Look at him. <laughs> <laughs> that's a beast. Yeah, that's a cow, bud. 
That's a Canadian move. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. Oh, dig oh. it. They never give up, bud. Man, there's some big Just fish in this it. water, eh? Come on, baby. <laughs> Come on. Come on, baby. Oh. Oh, he's not giving up. Got a boy, Jeffrey. Oh. There we go. There's a cow. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Shallow water spinner baits. Definitely. Look at the gut on Look this Look at guy. the size of this fish, bud. Not Look at that, boys. Now, that's a wide one. Yeah. yeah. I have just about had enough to though. I, my shore <laughs> is done. Oh, I haven't had enough, but I'll tell you what, I've had enough of the camera, because I want to relax and just do some fishing. We've yeah. had an absolutely fantastic time here. Between Beautiful. everything that we, from the time we, we pulled into Lancaster Park, it was just incredible. Great place. You know what? Unbelievable. Michael, a gentleman, Joy, was an absolutely pleasure to deal with. Brent? And Brent. Yeah. This yeah, guy, guy came out of nowhere, helped us the entire day, and even gave us baits to use. World-class fishery. Yeah, no kidding. Yeah, Absolutely, yeah. guys. You, you have to get out here, guys. Go to our website, fishtv.tv, for oh. more information <laughs> all about Lancaster Park. You'll have an absolute blast just like we did. Until next week, I'm Leo Stakos. <laughs> I'm Rod James. I'm Jeff Chisholm. We'll see you next time on Fish TV. I like current fishing yeah. now. <laughs> hey! Nice. All right, let him go, boys. All right. See you later, big guy. There was one. Down she goes. Look at this guy, look at this Beautiful. guy. Just swim right to the bottom, right <laughs> to the bottom. Fish TV was brought to you by Lund, the ultimate fishing experience, and Hill Street Beverage Company. Cheers to a better you.